Good morning, you absolute legends. Right, today's video, I thought let's do something different. I do it on my social media all the time as opposed to my TikTok, my Instagram, not so much on the YouTube, all right? Every single day I get in that thing that's behind you right now, which is an ice cold bath, all right? Every single morning, I've done that every single morning since the 1st of Jan, but I've been doing it for about two years now. Uh, not every single day for two years, but I'm trying every single day this year to get in that tub every single morning. It makes me feel unbelievable when I get out of the tub. Right now, your boys just got out of bed. The last thing you want to do is get a nice cold tub, trust me. But the discipline this builds is sensational. So I'm going to show you guys my whole morning routine. So let's go. It's a chilly one today as well, guys. It's never, well, it's not warm outside anyway, is it ever in the UK? I actually can't wait for. Where? Which light? Oh, get in there. Yeah. All right. I actually can't wait for it to be hotter outside. They set it like six degrees, so it's absolutely freezing. But if I was to do this when it's like 20 degrees outside, it would be a lot better. But anyway, let's get in. Trust me, guys, this never gets easier. It's, for, it's six degrees. You know, it's never going to feel warm. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So I stand out this every day, not wanting to get in. But we do it anyway, don't we? Ready? We start the timer. I'm only going to do two minutes today because you guys are watching. And you don't want to be sitting here watching me in for four minutes. Once I'm in, honestly, it's okay. You catch your breath. Obviously, normally I don't talk in here, I'm just deep breathing. Deep breaths in, hold for two seconds, and deep breaths out. And that's a way to get your breath back. But honestly, there is nothing that makes me feel this way that I've ever done before in my life. When I'm in here, like obviously now, I'm freezing, don't get me wrong. And that's a lot, what a lot of people will think about is just how cold they are. But what this is doing is literally sensational for your muscles, your joints, and not forgetting the brain. And what I mean by that is, something occurs when you do this called cold shock proteins. And if you, want to be fascinated by something, go and Google cold shock proteins because what that does to your body is insane. And the way that we feel, or well, I feel when I get out of this tub, is like nothing else I've ever done. Right, two, 20 seconds more. I normally do anywhere between two to four minutes. I don't do any more than four, I don't really need to. And you definitely don't need to do more than eight. Eight minutes is like the cutoff. Like everyone says, like, you know, see how long you can stay in there. But there's no more benefits after eight minutes anyway. Ah, beautiful. One more dunk. And that is one way to start the day. Ah, and now I'm out, yeah? Like, I don't feel, I don't feel cold. I do feel cold, obviously, but like, the hot, the air outside feels like warmer than when I got in there, because obviously I'm a lot colder. Look how lean I look, by the way, when you get out of these tubs. Like, that is basically just from all the bloat you ever had in your body is completely gone, because you're so cold. Like, this takes down any inflammation that you had, and this is how you look, that's how I look when I get out. Unbelievable. Now for the next thing, let's go. Next thing, obviously, we're getting dressed. So let's choose an outfit. 
Oh. Right. So the way I get trained, trained? The way I get dressed in the morning is work out what I'm training today. It's leg day. So I'm just gonna these on for the moment because I need to stretch in the mornings at the moment because your boy has killed his back. It's okay, it's not hurting too bad, but I've just introduced this into my new morning routine, which you guys are gonna see. Um, T-shirt's always a bit of an issue. These are all Alpha Elite T-shirts, apart from like, there's like two here that aren't. It's crazy. Um, but I wear Alpha Elite pretty much every day. Well, I do, so, like when I'm chilling in the house, I'll wear Alpha Elite. If I'm going to the gym, I'll wear Alpha Elite. If I'm going on a long drive, I'll wear Alpha Elite. Like, I always just wear Alpha Elite, because it's just, uh, well, my wardrobe's full of it, for one, and, I love the clothes. So what we're wearing today, I'm gonna put this on for now. This t-shirt, it's the exact same, pretty much. So this one's got athlete, uh, athletics on the back, like that. This one is my favorite t-shirt that Alfleet have ever done, right? This one here, the LDB on the front, and then Alfleet on the back there, but they don't obviously do this anymore. But this, this t-shirt, this is the exact same material as this t-shirt. And I love these materials. In fact, I'm gonna wear this one, because I absolutely love it. I don't know why I got the other one out. My wardrobe's a bit of a state. So we got these wardrobes built in a while ago, but honestly guys, I've got so many bags of clothes that I still haven't unpacked. It's a bit of a, it's a, bit of a joke, really. And then we're going for this wolf head. This is called the, I think it's called Origin. Origin crew neck. Oh yes. Now, let's move on. Okay lads, so now for the skincare. Now I do, again, I do this a lot on the socials. Um, that's not an ad by the way, I just use L'Oreal or Kiehl's. Um, today we're using the L'Oreal. The Kiehl's one, um, one I've run out of it, and I went to a L'Oreal event the other day and they gave me loads of products, which is fantastic. But L'Oreal owns Kiehl's, so you know you're getting a good product anyway. Um, there's three things I'm gonna use on here today. I've already used the, I've already used the face wash this morning. Um, and this is, this is like a perfect little combination actually. So what we're gonna do first is this one here is like a Hydra, um, sort of like a, it's called Hydra Energetic, but it's sort of just like an under eye roll. Hope you can still hear me through there. It's just to hydrate underneath the eyes, like that. And honestly guys, I cannot explain to you guys enough and why you should just look after your skin. I'm 32 next week, and I don't feel like I look 32 at all. And then the second, I say that, that sorry, that was not called Hydro Energetic. That's the whole, the whole um, range is called Hydro Energetic. What was that one called then? It's just the under eye roll, I know what it is. Um, and then this one is a vitamin C, that you need this stuff, guys, vitamin C drops. Now this has got 10% pure vitamin C. A lot of, lot of these um, vitamin C drops you can get nowadays have nowhere near that. This is perfect, you want loads of this stuff. Underneath the eye again. Get a bit more, I'll put a bit over the forehead as well. Takes seconds to do this in the morning, guys. I don't know, you know, about you, but if you want to look young, look after your face and your skin. Oh yeah, it feels unbelievable. And then, one more thing, I've got a bit in my eye. This one, this is, uh, SPF 50 moisturizer. You don't need huge amounts of this because obviously, obviously it's not hot where I am, but you still should be using um, SPF guys every single day, even if you're in the UK, because it protects from the UV light, not just sun damage, 
UV which comes from sun, even though there's no sun out at the moment, it's still a lot of UV light. Oh. So every day, use SPF. That is the main key ingredient to looking young, SPF. All right, that one's only 15, so it doesn't be, it's not huge. But SPF is the key to looking young, lads. Right, skincare in the back. And then the main thing that I go on so much on my social media is Ghost Greens. Now, on a serious note, guys, when I first started working with Ghost, people told me about these. And I was like, nah, I can't do greens. I've tried it millions of times, I just can't do greens. I've tried so many different brands of greens before I signed with Ghost. Then I tried the Ghost Greens uh, original, and don't buy original. I don't know why they do the original flavor. Maybe people, some, maybe some people like the original flavors, but, but maybe maybe because I don't even know why. But I don't like the original. But this is lime, and I'm telling you now, I look forward to this drink every single day. And I've probably had this drink every single day for two years, unless I've been away and I'm not taking anything with me. But this drink, not just because of, I don't obviously, it's not. I don't look think about the taste of this drink as much as what it's doing to my body. You know, this has 10 billion probiotics in it, all right? So our bodies have all got, um, you know, good good uh, bacteria and bad bacteria in them. We want good bacteria, all right? So this is basically what that's doing. This is putting good bacteria into your guts. If you struggle with digestion, if you struggle with bloating, this could also help your skin, you know? And I'm, I'm a massive believer in this, the why my skin's so good, not just the skincare that I do every day. This Ghost Greens has got so many good vitamins and nutrients in it. It is crazy good for you. And the only way to to make your skin look better is by starting from the inside out. So this stuff, every single day, don't don't skip this, guys. I'm telling you now, do not skip this. You guys know what to do. Code Kieran will save you 20%. And I know it sounds like such an ad, but trust me, go and buy yourself a pot of the fucking ghost greens. Do it for a month. Do it every day for a month because you've got 30 servings. Tell me how good you feel. Trust me. It's beautiful. Obviously it's gritty, but that's because it's just all greens powders and red powders in there. It's unbelievable. Ah, oh, yeah. I've left it sit for a little bit. I've got it. Ah. Honestly, my morning routine makes me feel unbelievable. The ice baths, the skincare, the greens. We're not finished though. Let's go. Something that I've added in to my morning routine now is stretching. I don't do enough of this. I used to do so much stretching when I was um, when I was an in-person PT because I used to have. Oh, hello. Hello. I used to have a, about an hour spare every morning to um, <clears throat> to just stretch. Like I used to just stagger my clients in the in the perfect way. So I'd get up, I get to the gym about half past six. I'd have a client at half six to half seven, and then a client from half seven to half eight. Then from half nine to half ten, I'd just do an hour stretching. Then clients, clients. Then I'd train. Then clients, clients, clients. It was just used to be unbelievable, but. I've neglected it a lot over the last couple of years, but not because I wanted to. Um, in my old flat, I didn't have any carpet and the mats I used to have were not as good. So I kind of just neglected it because of that, which I know is a poor excuse, but I used to, uh, so I used to be so flexible, but at the moment, I don't feel like I'm very flexible. So I normally try and do about, I normally try and do about sort of 10 minutes, nothing mad. I'm not being funny, even if you just lay on the floor and do some movements that you don't 
normally do in a day, like touch your toes for 10 to 15 seconds. It's better than doing nothing. I actually sometimes do this again in the evening, which does help a lot. And the only thing to do is coffee. In the morning, I sit here after I've done everything, after I've done the ice bath, the skincare routine, the ghost greens and the stretch. Having your coffee in silence before you start work, it's a game changer. It offers that little bit of like, right now, I've had a bit of five minutes peace let the mayhem begin sort of thing. Do you know what I mean? And I've also started drinking double espressos because I don't need a lots of fluid into my system. I've already drank about a litre and a half of water today. I've already had the ghost green, so I don't need more fluid in my body. Ah, beautiful. And I think now is the perfect sort of time to wrap this video up guys. And that is literally all I do for my morning routine. Now I say all I do, it sounds, it sounds like a lot and I get it. People do have other jobs than me. They have different work jobs, different um, you know, stuff they have to do, they might have kids, etc., etc. But there are routines that you can definitely do in a day, uh, in, in the morning. Um, and just make it super simple. So I've I've added to mine recently, but I wouldn't add to it if it was already causing me too much pressure or I was stressed out about it. You could have the most simplest of routines. And what I mean by that is you could literally just get up at the same time every morning, even on weekends. You have to get up at the same time even on weekends because it just sets the tone. And then brush your teeth at the same time, come downstairs, have a coffee and sit in silence five minutes. Everyone's got time to sit there for five minutes in the morning if you get up at a good time. So that could be your morning routine. I'm not saying you have to do exactly my routine. I'm not saying that. I was just wanted to show you guys what I do. And I know you guys always ask questions about my morning routines. And I post them a lot on my Instagram, my TikTok and things like that. So I thought I'd bring it to YouTube. And I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Um, the ice baths are a game changer, by the way. The ghost greens are a game changer. Sitting in silence is a game changer. Those three things for me... They're not going anywhere. Guys, I appreciate the love and support on the channel that you guys have been showing recently. Make sure we get this channel to 10K by the end of the year. Peace.